What's going on, y'all? Your boy Vernell right back at you. I want to talk about love a little bit, man. You know, I'm not an expert, but I know a little bit about love. Just, just enough to keep me out of trouble, right? And one thing I do know about love, man, love always believes in the best, right? Love believes the best. Um, love starts with me. Right? I can't love you if I don't love me. So first of all, in order for me to give you love i must have it for myself right i must i must i must practice love on myself i must i must know how to forgive myself and be patient with myself and be tolerant of myself love believe the best even when i'm falling short i believe in me i'm not i believe in me not because i'm cocky i believe in me because i love myself man right and when you love yourself you begin to do things that show that you love yourself you know I do things like go to work. Going to work is an expression of love, man. I, I, I take a bath. I wash up a little bit. I clean my home, man. I, I walk the dog. I take care of my personal responsibility, man. Love, believe the best. When I fall short, I get right back up. Right? You got to get right back up. You got to call somebody. Call somebody, man. Have some friends that want to help you. Be the best that you want to be because love, believe the best. You have to believe the best in yourself, man. Listen, if you don't believe in you, who will? <laughs> who going to believe in you if you don't believe in you? Love, believe the best. Stop going into that area of your mind that when you fall short, you begin to beat yourself up. Stop doing that, right? Put down the brick and pick up the feather. Start pick. Look, pick up the feather. Go light on yourself. You know, stop putting them high expectations on yourself. Love, believe the best. If you love yourself, you're going to believe the best for yourself. You have to believe in you. You have to walk in faith. You have to believe in you. You have to set goals. You love, believe the best. See, here's what happens. If you don't love yourself, you're not going to think positive things about yourself. See, people who don't love themselves, they think negative things about themselves. People who don't love themselves, they don't have no vision. They don't have no hope. They don't see God's glory all around them. They can't see the blessings that they're in because they don't love themselves, man. Love, believe the best. You have to believe in yourself. You have to believe in your in your ability to learn, right? You got to be able to learn. What, what is life about, yeah? <laughs> what, what is life about? Life is about learning and growing, evolving, right? And how do we learn? We learn by making mistakes. We learn by falling short. But here's the deal. If you don't know how to take a L, how can you be a winner? You have to, in order to be a winner, you got to know how to take a L. And in order to be a winner, you have to learn how to enjoy the journey. Man, life is not a destination, y'all. Life is a journey. Enjoy the journey. Pick yourself up. Walk by faith. Believe in yourself. You all right? You got you got two you got two minds, right? We got two minds. We got we got a we got a gratitude mind, right? We got we got somewhere that we can see the gratitude. Then we got another part of our mind that we always see is the negative. That's all we see. Everything negative, man. You ever has you ever known somebody no matter what happens, man, they just negative as heck. I mean they just negative. I got I know people, man, they wake up, they mad cuz they woke up. I'm mad. What you mad for? I woke up. You know, they mad because they woke up, right? So love, believe the best. So when you believe the best in yourself, because you love yourself, now you can give those things to others. You can show patience with them. Why? Because you're patient with yourself. You can show tolerance and, and unconditional love, right? And forgiveness because you practice it on yourself. Don't put high expectations on yourself, y'all. Allow yourself to be human. Man, I was telling a guy the other day, I said, look, man, I don't want to be so spiritual that I forget how to be human. <laughs> I don't want to be that spiritual, man. That's that's not my story. I'm not trying to be that spiritual. I, yeah, I love God. I love the Bible. I ain't trying to be so spiritual that I'm not human. No, I don't want that. I don't want no part of that. I just want to be able to accept people for who they are. 
And that's what I'm talking about. When you love yourself and you believe in yourself, don't let nobody tell you that something is wrong with you because you love yourself. That that's that's a lie. There's nothing wrong with loving yourself. There's nothing wrong with self-care. There's nothing wrong with putting yourself first to the point that you know that in order for you to be the person that you want to be, you're going to have to sacrifice and you're going to have to make it happen. See, too many people are put or getting into, into relationships, right? And they put these high expectations on their mates because they want their mates to bring happiness to them. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just I'm just keeping it 100 with y'all, man. Right? I love my wife. I got got nothing. There. I love my wife, man. But that's not her job, bruh, to make me happy. Now I'm already happy with me. Now she can add to it, but that's not her job to make me happy. Right? That's not that's not her job. See, I'm already happy. I, I like me. You know, there's nothing like being able to spend time with yourself. And be all right with it. There's there's nothing like, you know, falling short, man, and being okay with it. Not living up to my expectations, falling short, man. I don't beat myself up today. Well, you know, if I don't feel like in the mood, I'm in the mood to, to, to go to work. I just don't feel like I'm in the mood to go to work. It's okay. I mean, I go anyway, but it's okay, right? We have to stop making decisions based on what we feel, man. Right. Based on what we think. Right. We just had to do the right thing for the right reason. So love, believe the best. What do you believe about you? Do you believe the best about you? Do you really, truly believe the best about you? Do you think you deserve that promotion? Do you think you deserve the home that you always wanted? Think about all the dreams that you had, man. It's not too late. Think about that book you've been thinking about procrastinating, man, for years. Talking about you going to write. Think about that book. If you believe the best, man, you put the work in. See, that's one thing about this work, man, right? I mean, this thing called faith. We got to put in the work, right? They say faith without work is dead, bro. It's dead. Trick no good. You got to put in the work. Well, I'm waiting on God, okay? You keep waiting on him. I'm waiting on him too, man. In the process, I'm going to be putting in his work. I'm waiting on God. I'm going to be putting in his work while I'm waiting on God. Real, real, real talk, man. Love, believe the best. When your kids are struggling, what are you saying to yourself about your children? Let's keep it real, man. What are you saying? Do you really believe the best? Do you believe the best? Do you go over there and, and help them? Or do you encourage them? Huh? Try to motivate them. Or do you tag them? And say things like, look at him. He's just going to be just like his daddy. Huh? Let's keep it 100, man. Right? We're going to keep this thing all the way 100. Love, believe the best. When, when you're struggling, you're struggling. Can't get a job. Love, believe the best. You have to love yourself. Because when you love yourself, you're going to believe that you deserve the best. Right, you're not gonna settle for just any old dude. You're not just gonna settle for any old woman. Why? Because you believe the best. You believe that you deserve the best. You deserve the best woman. You deserve the best job. You deserve respect. You deserve the best. Love believes the best. Right? I'm gonna wrap this thing up and I'm gonna let y'all know, man, that if you don't love yourself and you don't put yourself first, man, who gonna do it? If you don't respect yourself, how do you expect other people to respect you? It's your boy Vernon L. And I'm out, man.